So we are looking to move because right now we have two people in a little bachelor apartment and we're running a business out of it so it gets a little bit crazy. So right now we're gonna check out a few places and we're gonna show them to you guys as well. So this is the living room. There's a fireplace mantle. We could always put a little fake one under there. It's kind of pretty, it fits our TV perfectly. You can actually see a little cute house. It's got more windows than our last place, which is really nice for summer because we'll actually be able to feel like it's summer when we're inside. Josh's peephole. So he can check if I'm still alive when I'm meal prepping. It's the kitchen. Lots of covered space. Sweet black fridge too. Little, little wine spot. It's a bedroom. This is pretty much like the size of our last apartment all together. Pretty good closet. There's shelves. And there's spots to hang. This will mostly be my stuff. And the bathroom. It looks like a hotel bathroom. It's a lot nicer than that though. Yeah. So modern. I love it. I like the big sink. This is really cool. It has like a little half bit showing. So the stuff you use every day could be there. I like bright. This light's really cool. There we go, look at that. I like that. What do you think of this one? I like it a lot. Uh, it's a lot more modern than our other one. Uh, a lot more room, especially for LVD, if we're gonna start working more, inviting people over to work on it. Um, and yeah, it's closer to downtown or more in the center of downtown, I guess. It's literally... It's downtown. It's downtown. <laughs> Instead of center town. Yeah. Yeah, I like it. It's really bright, which I like. And the kitchen is like a lot more space and covered space, which is... Yeah. Covered space, which is huge. Yeah. You guys gonna go check out the other one? Yeah. Here's the other place. It's kind of cool. It has an island. A little darker, I feel. Yeah, it doesn't get as much sunlight. No, not, no, not natural light. It has the same cool light as the bathroom. That was my owl. Moldery. Yeah, there's Oh, nothing... the bathroom's not bad. No, there's not as much space in general. Like, it's nice though. My shower head. Let's see the room. Okay, okay. Um, Ah, uh, that's really small. Yeah. I, I think I'd better just fit in there. Apparently, this one has a patio deck, though. A patio deck? Or a deck. A so, balcony. A balcony. Apparently, it has a balcony. I get it. So, let's check that out. Ooh. Jeez. This is huge. Now, stay there. Like, look at that. Yeah. It's a lot of space. So, I'm not sure overall thoughts on this place. I really, really like the balcony because that was a really big thing for me. I hate not being outside that much in summer. So, I love the balcony. Like, it's massive. The only thing is, like, I don't like the inside as much. Like, I feel like. This joint area is kind of cool because I can be meal prepping while you're hanging out. But it definitely feels like smaller overall. Like the bedroom would be the main problem because it's basically just like the bed. Like if you have to jump into bed. Yeah, and I feel like it's more like a, definitely like an individual person place and not like a two people place. And like not much room for LVD, kind of. I just want the other place with this balcony. <laughs> I know, if only. We gonna eat. You already said. 
record for like two seconds. Keep going. Because you said no, that you should I mean, keep going. Yeah, I know. She told me to keep recording for editing purposes. But and you do it as in like you're thinking of something else to say when it's clearly over. It never plays it. some yummy yummy pho and finished off with some bubble tea because I have a little bit of a free day since I've been so good lately. Gains. <laughs> um, I'm going to finish this week's video off with a little bit of training from Wednesday. We went to Queen's View Good Life which is one of the gyms that most of the YMCA lifters went to when it closed. Yeah, it was a great, great atmosphere, great environment. Uh, we literally took up probably two squat racks and all the benches. Uh, just power lifters everywhere. Yeah, so we only have a little bit of time left in our place before we move, which is exciting. But we got some yeah. bubble tea, so we're going to have that, watch some Netflix, and then head out for the evening. See you. Like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> Please. Power lifting. Mayo has so much swag. today, Mario? Um, that, 6 sets 4, 420, pond squat, the RP8, hopefully do around 4, 6 years up, and then some deadlift, and uh, eat more mini eggs. So, so this vlog is brought to you by Mini Eggs. We have a sponsored athlete right here. Mario Gibbs. Cynthia, Gibbs. <laughs> Cynthia <Bo. laughs> PR attempt, let's go. Yeah, up, 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 yeah. Lock it, hold it. Yeah. <laughs> hey, come on, let it out more than that. <laughs> there you go. What is that? 510. Good stuff. What was your last PR? Uh, 500. Not bad. There you go. 10 pound PR. Just, almost fell. Just when we thought winter was over. Oh my god. <laughs> Are you doing that? Are you gonna do it? I did it to get here. <laughs> April. Are you serious? 